I could not have said it better myself. After more than a four-year hiatus, professional football is indeed back in St. Louis, and these fans ready to go. The local team paying homage to the Stanley Cup champions as the Battle Hawks enter the arena in Blues garb. This is a progressive countdown to kickoff, and today from St. Louis, Missouri, the hometown St. Louis Battle Hawks host the New York Guardians. To Jones again. Big hole! Jones trying to grab the sideline and a foot race to the 20 and he'll carry it inside the Guardians red zone. Andrew Soro with the shove out of bounds. It's a 49-yard scamper. This is why Chuck Long is so excited about his quarterback. It's a two-deep high safety. He checks down to the run, which is the correct call. This is a physical football team, and if you play two deep high safeties, they will run it down your throat. And they'll do it again. Straight ahead, a bruising run for a St. Louis touchdown. Christine Michael. Play. Tamu going in zone. It is batted away. Great coverage in the back end. I don't know that St. Louis could have started this game any better. Running the ball on the ground, New York clearly playing coverage, and they're just running down their throat. And these fans are excited. Play clock at three. Pressure coming. Over the middle, complete. Able to find his tight end, Jake Powell, who rumbles in the Battle Hawks territory. St. Louis one and one in the season. They won their road opener against Dallas. They lost last week. King led the NFL in punting at 14 for the Raiders. Flag on the play, leaping catch at the 20. And after the 30-yard line goes Duke. Wesley Sutton, the safety, came in and made contact with Mark White King. There's only a fourth and two. This is huge. Kicker. Kicking leg on New York. I got running into the kicker, so it's going to be a first down. Okay. Previous spot, five yards. It's Brandon Cruz. Running into the kicker. Defense, number 28. That five-yard penalty results in a first down. This gets medical attention. Tiamu with the rollout. Flag on the play. He'll throw on the run down the sideline. And LaDamian Washington just got lit. That'll bring a flag. A.J. Hendry laid a lick on LaDamian Washington. Which has already been called. How about this unnecessary roughness? You've been hit like that before. I have been hit by like that before. It's shoulder to shoulder. I understand the spirit of the rule, but I don't know what they expect the safety to do. Williams hands it off. A burst of speed. Darius Victor. Five 50 yarders in his time at K-State. And this one is driven through the uprights. The XFL kickoffs, they look different. Kicker from the 30. Return team lined up at the opposite 30. Can't move to the ball is fielded. And here goes Keith Mumphrey. And they're going to turn it around with room on the near side. And for the first time, they get creative. And the Battle Hawks have the sideline. And a kickoff return for Joe Powell to the end zone. And now they say he stepped out. No, touchdown, St. Louis. Undrafted free agent of the Giants. And on the reverse, the first of its kind. And every week, we're going to see more and more returns as teams get used to these new rules. This was the first reverse. You got to knock off one guy because the guy you're blocking is right in front of you. If you reverse field and come back around, now it's all about getting in the end zone and the foot stays in long enough. And we have our first touchdown. Guardians bring four. Tiamu to the slant. That is caught for a first down for the Battle Hawks. Demorne Pearsonell. 39-yard attempt coming out of the timeout. High snap. King able to get it down, and a field goal is good. Blocked. Battle Hawks with another fine special teams play. It's scooped up. They're looking for another score. Shaq Jones with the return.
Vogel had it taken right off of his foot. Carlton Agadosi, the wide receiver out of Rutgers. Matt Jones in. Touchdown, St. Louis. Little toss and a pass off of it. The morning Pearson out to Alonzo Russell. With the play finishing inbounds. Pressure coming from the edge. McGloin intercepted. What a grab by Kenny Robinson. And the 21 year old out of West Virginia has a takeaway. His first as a pro and an extra tackle on the sideline. Robinson celebrates while fisticuffs occur on the Guardian sideline. Mikhail McKay absolutely trucked one of the Battle Hawks defenders, Dexter McCoy. Robinson ineligible at West Virginia this year. Instead of playing for the Mountaineers, he's playing in the XFL. He's got his first pro pick. Tiamu stays on his feet, and he whistles one complete for a first down to Alonzo Russell. Ranthony Tejada had him around the ankles. Nobody's playing with more confidence than Tom is playing right now to be able to have the ability to not just stay up. Rosalino's made from 39. Got the leg. Wow. By an eyelash from 58. Did you come for the kicker celebration? Because we got the kicker celebration. <laughs> Taken down. Andrew Ankrow with the sack. It's a loss of eight. Darius Victor stood up at the line of scrimmage and stopped. And St. Louis turns him over on downs. Devontae Lambert, Terrence Garvin able to make penetration. With the guy that you came with. Well, just like McGloin was benched last week, now Silberman is benched. Damian Mama takes over, and he clears a hole for Tim Cook the third. And Cook taken down at the 15-yard line. Fastball too high. And the Guardians turn it over on downs again. Jordan Tiamu trying to buy some time. And now he'll use his legs. And he picks up a first down by staying in bounds. Here in St. Louis, mentioned he played in his NFL career at the Old Bush Stadium against the Cardinals. Here's Mikhail McKay, who takes it inside the 10. Third quarterback of the day. That is a play that works. Austin Duke is in for the touchdown for the Guardians on an eight yard play. At the 25 year old Luis Perez getting the Guardians on the board with Austin Duke handling the heavy lifting. <laughs> and a St. Louis first down for Matt Jones. Third and 11. Go routes all over the place except for the check down to Tillery. And he picks up the St. Louis first down. All the way down to the 25 on a gain of 22. Russellino. Got a wedding coming up in May. Today. Tailgating tents went up early. 
inside and out. There's, these fans have been terrific today. It's going to be interesting to see this team moving forward as they get another win. First game in 1,529 days of professional football here in St. Louis and a successful return to the Gateway City.